everybody norm over here and i've got lemo and everybody the other <laughs> night was screaming lemo 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 yes, and uh, the band was really slamming i gotta tell you it was really really good um we had a great time i made a whole night of it i drank too much i stayed at the uh, sunset marquee hotel you know jen took a picture of us and i gave somebody the finger i was Whoa. just kidding around you know all you guys that don't get uh, you know have a sense of humor and don't get the finger. Here's two for you. But, uh, we love you guys, and uh, that's just. You're a party animal. I, uh, I'm yeah. a party animal. Meanwhile, the next day I was like semi comatose. <laughs> but the band was really killing because, I mean, Mike here is, in my opinion, one of the greatest guitar players I've ever heard. Oh. And when he plays by himself, that's very difficult to do. His band, though, was killing. And the drummer and bass player were yep. solid as a rock, playing simple and just the right stuff. The tempos were fantastic. Yep, the I grooves were really good. Phil and Greg, that was my yep. bass player and drummer, and uh, they did a great job. And everybody that came out, it was so amazing. I have not had that much support in a long time. <laughs> yeah, well, everybody in the audience is screaming, Lemo, Lemo, yeah. Lemo, <laughs> and I was over guy. there giving them <laughs> And he was flipping them off. Yeah. <laughs> Lemo! <laughs> yeah, so, but it was great. We had a great time. And I want to tell you about this week's podcast because it's a really good one. My buddies Tom Ball and Kenny Salt. Well, I'd be one happy son of a bitch if somebody would make me bitch. Give me a penny, penny, I want some dough. Jill, give me some bread, bread, I want some jing, bing. Well, I want to be a filthy rich. Hey! And those guys are the next best thing to Sonny Terry and Brownie McGee. Those guys, you know, it's a great acoustic blues duo. Those guys have been playing together for almost 40 years and they kill. So you got to check out the podcast. This is a really good one. And uh, I want to thank you guys for supporting us and watching the podcast. And all you guys that don't, <laughs> oh, that has to be at least seven I'm sorry, now. I'm sorry. You count the double. Right. Have a sense of humor, you guys. Anyhow, Lemo was great. It was a great night. Sunset Marquee is the bomb. We're going to show you a little some parts of the hotel. That's where Joe Bonamassa hangs out when he's in town. He's got a little Bonazium there. Yes, he does. As we walk over this away, <laughs> you can see there is part of the Joe Bonamassa display from the Bonazium. That's the uh, Joe Bonamassa Museum. And you know, this amp and this guitar look very familiar to me. The reason being is I sold them to Joe. And now they're in the Bonamassa Museum. They even have some of the uh, Fender paperwork. And by the way, look at this. Here's a really beautiful 56 Fender P bass. And that one looks familiar to me too. You know why? Why, Michael Lemo? Because it came from Norman's Rare Guitars. Thank you very much. <laughs> this place is the true rock and roll hotel. Yes. And there's how many recording studios in the hotel? Three. Wow. We tried to get in there, but they were all busy. They didn't want the riffraff <laughs> they didn't in there, want us. so they threw us out. So, uh, but it was really cool, and it, it's really the place to stay. You're, you're a block off of Sunset Boulevard, right near the Roxy, the Whiskey, all the places you want to go, all the great restaurants. And But it's uh, almost like you wouldn't even know it when you're you there. You wouldn't. It's slightly removed. It's really beautiful. And, uh, you know, unless you walk a block over, you think you're in a different place yeah. altogether. So it's my favorite hotel. If, if anybody's yeah. going to be staying and in uh, Hollywood and wants the music the rock and roll know, experience, vacation I think so that's it that's the place you want to stay is a sunset marquee and for all you guys who can't spell it's not M-A-R-K-E-E -E or M-A-R-K-E-Y it's M-A-R-Q-U-I-S-U <laughs> love you guys Thanks I'm going to just do watching. this to make up for it <laughs> me too oh I mean that sorry alright thank you guys so much